Welcome back to the Tenkai Project. Or Project Tenkai. Earthbound RCO Edition. Last time... Our inventor friend has made a crash landing in the party. And he joined. And... Now we're going to actually get the hell out of here. And it didn't take us that long because, as you can see... With only a few bucks to our name. We have 40 at level 19. Bina at level 10. And we're at level 12. So the only thing we have to do now is get the hell out of here. The door is locked. Well, this is the reason why we have... The bad key machine. So it's time for us to get the hell out of here. If you're wondering if I'm going to do the first game in the future, I might. So as you can tell, that is the secret base. And now we are at even grounds now. Of course, somebody would mention that the fact is, I don't know why people are wondering why I'm dealing with three. The fuck? Oh. Right. PK freeze! PK freeze PK flash Oh <laughs> That was really close. And Foy is now level 20! And offense up goes by 3! Defense goes up by 3! Guts up by 2! IQ goes up by 2! Luck up goes by 1! Max HP goes up by 1! And, oh good luck! Max Psy Power goes up by 8! And 40 finally gets Life Up Beta. Bina is now level 11. Her offensive goes by, goes up by two. Defense by one. Speed by two. Max HP by one. Max side power by one. And Bina learn PK freeze beta. Double. Oh we need to. We need to get Ryu heal fast.
We'll be dealing with the um, tent very shortly, but first we need to get um, healed, among other things. Yeah, that's what we're going to next, right after we get um, our party properly healed. Let's see. That spells right down there. Oh, but let's go by the um, hotel because I need to pull some money out. Silly just to put the put the hospital right there, which it should be next to the hotel. But mm. I should have something defense related for. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Do I have any guys that. Ah, uh, yeah, let's do that right now since, since I actually have that. Let's do the following. Let's give the broken machine over to Ryu. Remember, you want to give anything that's broken to this guy because he can actually fix things. I can see more people are going in there. If we want to get more um, bottle rockets, we go to that guy right down there. He's an arms dealer. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. you it's random so let's say you know after the fact that you rest a few times you can actually just like if you want to do so you can grind or just spend like 120 just to just to do the following so yeah I'm going to do that a little bit. And let's do... Because we're going to get some money back, don't worry.
you don't look so happy, you better cheer up or you'll become a zombie. Some people have already become tools of the zombies. Well, I'm sure they have. It's been a circus tent the center of town for a long time. Sign our attempt to the south. I wonder what I wonder when it went up. Magic butterfly. Yeah, that is a weird thing now, isn't it? Let's see. The handsome Tom. Should at least bolster some kind of sense of EXP. a nice cozy bed. Come on to the west. We're right there. Three Sunset Hotel. Now you're probably wondering why are we going there? Simple. No pitching of tents in this area without permission. <laughs> Meet our next boss. The Boogie Tent. Now this is very important that you do take on this boss because he has an item that we're going to need. Let's see. Let's see. Can I use PK process? Actually, no, no, no. Let's do it fun. Defend. Defend. Spy. That's one thing you don't want. That's 43. Defense 69. Runnable to scythe. PK fire. Okay. That's all we need to know. Alright, so... Let's try some paralysis. Fire. Let's see, do I have anything? Yeah, sure. PK Safe! It doesn't work. PK Safe. Really, dude? PK fire! <laughs> that should do it. So, Bean is now level 12. Offensive goes up by 2. Speed goes up by 1. Guts go up by 2. Vitality goes up by 2. IQ goes up by 2. Max HP goes up by 23! <laughs> And Psy Power goes up by 9. And we use levels now, 13. Max HP goes up by 3. And it goes up another level. Defense goes up by 2. IQ goes up by 1. Max HP goes up by 2. And that's it. And with that, 
We should get the most important, and I do mean the most important item you can ever have. And I, and I can, um, indeed, use it. Okay, the PK sigh ain't working, so I'm... Paralysis. Psy paralysis. I'll call it that. Psy paralysis. Anyway, um... Then I close up through it. Oh, let's see, what's in here? The jar of fly honey. Now you're probably wondering what is this item so important that you need it for? Well, we're gonna need it for a certain boss that'll be coming up pretty soon, but the most important thing we took care of was the boogie tent. There's graffiti here. Just play it. Well, okay then. <laughs> now let's see. Since I kind of wasted... Let's see, how much did I waste? Since I kind of wasted, oh, not much of anything. Because a big bottle rocket and, um... A big bottle rocket and... Hello. Hello, this is, this is Apple Cat. I just want to let you know that I sent a pretty big invention. I'm not sure if it will help you or not. It's called Zombie Paper. It can be used to trap zombies. Perfect. It works kind of like fly paper. All you need to do is place the paper on the floor of a tent or something. You see at least one tent around, right? And then the zombies get stuck in the paper. They move around inside the tent. You can catch a lot of zombies this way. In fact, I bet you can get rid of all the zombies that are terrorizing the area with this paper. Anyway, I just asked the mock pizza delivery man to deliver the zombie paper to your party. You should get it pretty soon. I've never actually seen a zombie, but if there really are any, zombie paper would be very, very useful. I'll be calling you if I come up with anything else. Eeeh. <laughs> So, anytime now will be good. Um, we're just gonna go up here. Well, delivering pizza, this weird guy asked me to, asked me to help him out. He wanted me to deliver this to someone named Forty, who was wandering around three. No one else knows about this, right? Let's just pretend that you're Forty, and I'll give you this to you. Oh, hello, Forty. Uh, just go along with me on this one, okay? I made the decision that you're Forty, no matter what. Thank you. So we get the zombie paper. That's right, Forty. I've done my duty and given you apple kids, thank you, Jake. Well, goodbye. You're probably thinking, are, did things just get much weirder? Yes, it has. So we're gonna pretend that none of this shit ever happened, and I'm just gonna go rest and then deal with that problem that's right in front of us. No. Working through the night, Ryu fixed the broken air gun. After being fixed, the broken air gun became the Magnum air gun. So there you go. He only has to reach the peak level of his IQ in order to make certain items and weapons. So now that we have something better, well, 
Ryu can actually make his own weapon, so therefore, no need for the pop gun. But something even better. A magnum air gun. It makes a lot of sense now, doesn't it? So, let's see, where's the shop? The shop's right there, so we can sell that pop gun. Really, guys? Really, guys? No, he's down. And Bina's level is now 13. Luck up goes by 1. Max HP up by 2. Ryu is now at level 15. With the offense going up by 1. Guts go up by 1. IQ goes up by 1. Max HP goes up by 1. And that's it. Sounds so car cartoony, doesn't it? Yeah, I like to sell something. I like to sell. The following. This pop gun. Don't need it. Not like I need a pop gun anymore. Let's see, what can I pull and what can I get? Let's see. Hard hat and copper bracelet. That's 650. Okay, 650. That's about 650, so let's just pull that out. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. You know what, man? Let's make it an Evo 700. There we go. Yeah, I'd like to buy something for my friend Rio Jeff here. I'd like to buy. Also, I'd like to buy a copper bracelet. Yep. 30 to 35. That's good. Yes, buy that cheap bracelet, please. That'll work. Nope. So since since we can actually take care of this right now, let's do that. Let's go inside the circus. Cause everybody loves a good circus. And, uh, so you're gonna use this tent as a trap. Yep. 
Well, we'll give it a try. It's better than nothing, I guess. Maybe a good idea would be to get all... Maybe a new good idea would be try to get all the zombies into a single spot. You can do whatever you want. Just save my life! Just give us something and... Just, just give us some green, sir. This guy at the Pizza Joy told me about a new product called Zombie Paper. Yeah, of course. We're going to use the zombie paper. Hope you don't mind. So we're going to place it on the floor. And then leave. I think. Leave and then come back. <clears throat> hey, hey, stupid zombies! Come on over! That's gonna work. Just imagine when we wake up tomorrow morning. Ugh, it'll be, it'll be gross. We can do whatever you want, just say my life. Yeah, we know. Hey, stupid zombies, come out, come out wherever you are. This is Spitz is killing me. Here, zombie, zombie. Here, zombie, zombie, zombie. I have a nice bone for you. Zombie paper is a stupid product name. The only one way we can figure out if it's stupid or not is we have to wait. And how do we wait? Well, we have to technically wait. Wait, I got enough. And we wait. And as you can see, all the zombies are leaving the nest. Just like a flock of seagulls coming to my aid. smell flesh. They're all going in the tent. Even the dog. A few days ago, the zombies got some kids at this hotel. The boy had a red cap. Hey! It was you! Yes, it was you. Sir... You're working hard even though you're young. The guest newspapers that were delivered to the hotel to, to the hotel today are different than normal. The paper's called the Zombie Herald. I'm scared, but let me tell you what's in, what's in it. Boogie Tent Falls, young human to blame. Yeah, that Boogie Tent! Well, let's see. Well, let's see what our plan resulted. It seemed like everybody's in there. Well, what's going on? You might not understand my saying this, but poor zombies. Poor zombies, and you've been complaining about them all this time. Yeah, we got a lot of zombies. Ugh, it's really gross. Of course, they're they're the undead. Of course, they're gross. I was able to arrest many zombies because of your help. Arrest sounds strange, doesn't it? Yes, you're arresting the undead. Yeah, that does. That sounds rather weird. We did it! Did you look in the tent? <laughs> we taught those stupid zombies a lesson! And this is where the Walking Dead became a household item. Well, damn. They're, they're just all stuck down. Zombie paper really works. So, I hope someone comes up with pretty girl paper. Oops, that was a nice thing to say. Pretty girl paper. 
If only, sir. If only. These zombies stuck to the floor. I wonder if they could still get me. I don't care what happens to anyone else. I just want to save my own skin. Can I just pull one up and just let them rip your face off? I, I just want to... I, I can't do that? I can't do that? Ass. You say that's terrible because we did what you wanted and now you're complaining about oh hey this is inhumane and yet still no thank yous man that's some bullshit Yeah, I don't think they're going to be coming back. It's just, just like, you know. I think there's something else I need to do before I leave. Give me a second here. I'm going to check my list. Okay. Now, the next thing we have to do is we have to go northwest. <coughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Hi, handsome Tom. Bye, handsome Tom. Earthbound. RNG's Revenge. Coco Tin? A Coco Tin. I love when people just say, oh, well, you know, we, we shouldn't have been that way. Make up your goddamn mind. You either do or you don't like what we're doing. We're so inhumane. No. Letting, letting, letting someone that isn't worth living is being inhumane. You know what I mean, someone who just said, I'm not worth shit, I'm not worth A, B, C, D, F, G. You know, someone who's just, you know, feeling sorry for themselves just because, oh, tough shit, tough shit, and all that bullshit. This is not Northwest. No, not interested. Not interested in the bullshit. Really, guys? No good fly. When you have a no good fly, that only means one thing. Jack, this shit's happening, that's what it is. Well, let, let's just use some PK freeze. Let him waste time! We don't care. PK freeze! Beautiful! Mm. 
Get something stronger. PK freeze! Urban zombies, yo. And we're, no, we're not talking about Pokemon Go either. to the bank, bitch. And we know Ryu shot him in the head. <laughs> and for that, he gains another level. Offense goes up by two. Defense goes up by two. Speed goes up by one. Vitality goes up by one. IQ goes up by two. Luck goes up by one. Max HP goes up by nine. Konami, is this you're doing? I'm quite concerned about this. You're a friend. But actually, you're just a commoner. I am a merchant of the other kind. The mini barf. Do, 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 ba, do, do. Why does this remind me of a Muppet of some kind? Seriously, it looks like a Muppet. Look at it. Let's see if I can put it to sleep. I really want to see if I can put it to sleep. Let's see. Game is 45. Defense 45. Defense 71. It's PK5. Okay. Okay. We've learned now. Okay. I put you to sleep. Damn it. It doesn't put him to sleep. That is some bull bullshit. Well, since we've learned, do I have anything? Oh. BK FIRE!
There. No visible effect. Lovely. Okay. Make use of it. Damn it. Kind of what kind of attack is that? So like Take it out somewhere. Tell, tell why it doesn't work. Oof. Take it out, please. Can we please take that this thing out? Oh! That's it. We win. Oh. And 40 is now at level 21. Speed goes up by 1. Luck goes up by 1. Max HP goes up by 3. Ryu's now at level 17. Guts go up by 1. Max HP goes up by 3. Ryu is now also at 18. Offense up by 2. Max uh, Max HP up by 2. I wait to get your flash on a Gurby down. Master Belgian, I love flash on a Gurby And this leads us into the weirdest place ever known. You must have a long, tough road ahead of you, do you not? No, there's no need to explain, I already know. You must be hungry. This is good timing for you, I happen to be carrying something to eat. What would you like? Oh, let's see, we got a croissant, a calorie stick, and a cup of coffee. A cup of coffee! No, 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 please, by all means, come back again. Ah, I just remember, there's a village with many interesting people just ahead. You should go there and visit. I heard that the name of the village is Saturn Valley, but it cannot be found on any map. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Did I mention oh, shit? This place that we're going up to Red Antoids and Black. Put me to bed. Damn, damn, stupid, stupid, damn, damn. We are put to the bed. So we'll have to Dragon Quest this thing. <laughs> Good lord! <laughs> Fortnite is now level 22. Offense goes up by 3. Vitality goes up by 1. Max HP goes up by 11. Max Psy Power goes up by 1. And 40 has realized the power of PK Gaming Beta. Um, so 
So yeah, we're just going to carry out like normally and just walk through this area. Protein drink. <sighs> yeah, we're definitely gonna need some help. Can I squish it? The violent rup. Can I kill it with fire? This roach ain't doing shit! We'll be okay, I think. Hearing some weird ass shit now. I'm gonna write in my voice for this shit because it's gonna get weird. Bottle rock. Okay, so I'm done with Roach Coach. Yeah, that, yeah, that thing is dead. <laughs> that thing is dead. Just, and, and, and mind you, it's it's usually guts and good boy. I'm, I want to get them back up so they can get some of this experience. Here we are. Presenting the most derpiest place in the planet of Earthbound. Saturn Valley. It's a groove! Hi, homie, Mrs. Saturn! This place holler, Mrs. Saturn! Yes, everybody here is Mr. Saturn. Once upon a time, we were many, many, every day slowly part, mellish, mess. What am I doing? I'm Dr. Saturn Doom, and I can repair your body too. Do you want me to operate on you, thing? Yes. You are feast up! Goody gong! Free for everything, folks. Because we just entered Derp Valley. Derp Valley, man. A rust promoter. Well, the CEO of Fire Gumpar Park! There's a thing in the thing I see! Yeah, I wanna talk to my. <laughs> I wanna talk to my lord. Yeah, uh. Um, it's like. Yes, Hardy? I mean, never gonna believe this shit. I'm, I'm in a world of dirt. So I heard that you got a new girlfriend on your journey. What, what? Well, why don't you tell me about her later? She has this feeling that she is right next to you or something. She, she's kind of breathing down my neck. <clears throat> well, she is right there. Say hello to her for me. Mom says hi. I have to go now. I'm right in the middle of cleaning the toilet. But You're what? N never mind. Yeah, I'm going to call my dad to tell him um, I I've reached Derp Valley. Or it's your dad. Deposit $2,863 into your bank account. Taking away what you've spent, you should now have $2,130 in the bank. Well, experience again is like $2,420. Okay. Anyway, what do you need from me? I need, you, I need to record this shit. Well, done. 
Your dear old dad was also thinking about hitting the hay for a night. I have created a record of your adventure to this point. Good night. Sleep tight. Ah, oh, continue. Boy, you, work, you like to work hard, just like your mother. I don't like, think, but I don't think it's good to work too hard. The weirdos on this thing. So, um... On our next, um, episode of... Earthbound RC Audition, we have reached Derp Valley, and yes, Derp is about to happen. Cause we doing the fight the fortune, the fight the fall, point taken! Yeah, stay tuned for the next part.